we have a kind of a new area that we're getting into that is um, really um, a challenge for us at Planned Parenthood because it is it is very much out of sort of the, 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 the reproductive health that we usually work on. Um, and that issue is around environmental toxins. So things like how do pesticides you know, affect fertility? How do pesticides, um, are, are pesticides linked to birth defects, um, to fetal development, things like that? We've joined a coalition with Healthy Legacy, which is a coalition of environmental groups and groups that support children to support an agenda that you know, basically tries to um, limit the environmental impact of toxins on newborns, on, on fetal development, and you know, through things like the pesticide, is it called the pesticide right to know, remember the first yep. one, which is a really big piece of legislation, especially in farm, farm country. We're still in a, an ad, you know, we still have a large agricultural sector, and the legislators that are sponsoring that legislation are from um, rural Minnesota. At this stage, we are part of this coalition, and we will be working, you know, doing letters of support to the legislature, doing letters of support to the governor if it gets that far, you know, offering our support it's not, I wouldn't say, sort of a tier one issue, but it is something that we, I do believe, begin need to begin to get involved in because you know reproductive rights and reproductive justice is also the ability to have healthy children, and if we are all being affected by an environment by an environment that we don't understand and we can't control, and that corporate America is you know poisoning our, our future, we have a right to know that and we should be involved. And so this is a real, uh, gr it's, unfortunately, it's a growth area and it's something that we need to keep track of. Planned Parenthood is very willingly getting involved in this, but we are sort of taking our time because it is, again, a little bit out of our, a little bit out of our um, traditional area of influence. We have other issues that are a little bit more core to our mission that are actually like things about providing reproductive health healthcare, making sure we have funding necessary, make sure that we are actually pushing still that prevention of unintended pregnancies and everything else. But we're very excited about being involved with Healthy Legacy. And I would encourage everybody to go to healthylegacy.org if you want a good scare, because it is a remarkable the stuff that's out there. And um, the things that I've learned at some of these conferences you know, are, are really you know, very revealing and it'd be worth just as a citizen to understanding a little bit more about your environment.